Rockets Jabari Smith Jr. leaving positive impact despite shooting struggles. But first, if you're new here on the channel, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any Houston Rockets news, make sure to leave a like so YouTube can keep delivering the latest news from the Houston Rockets. Despite his shooting struggles, Jabari Smith Jr. has left a positive impact on the Houston Rockets when it comes to the team's defense and rebounding. A day after the Houston Rockets dropped their seventh consecutive game in a loss to the Minnesota Timberwolves, Jabari Smith Jr. was the first player putting up shots Monday morning during practice. Smith's nine-point performance against the Timberwolves marked the third consecutive game he shot 30% or below. And during his three-game slump, Smith has averaged 8.7 points on 29.6% shooting, 17.6% from behind the arc. With the exception of a handful of 20-point performances, the Rockets have yet to experience Smith as the sharpshooting big man who averaged 16.9 points on 42% shooting during his freshman season at Auburn. But Smith has already positively impacted Houston's defense and hustle through the first quarter of his rookie campaign. Jabari Smith is slowly but surely coming along, coach Steven Silas said. Some of the defensive plays he made, Sunday, night. Those are some of the things I am proud of. Silas said improving the Rockets' rebounding, paint and rim protection was a priority through the offseason. And through the first half of his first season, Smith has helped Houston enhance in all three areas. He has recorded at least one block in 28 out of a possible 40 games and is currently second on the team in rebounding, averaging 7.0 boards. Smith's most impressive game that best illustrated his hustle and defensive impact came during Houston's 97-92 win over the Milwaukee Bucks on December 11. From contesting jump shots to playing the passing lanes that led to three steals, Smith had several moments where he made defensive stops on Giannis Antetokounmpo. Smith held Antetokounmpo to 16 points as the primary defender. His best defensive play came early in the third quarter. He rejected Antetokounmpo's layup attempt, which led to Kevin Porter Jr. converting a dunk on the offensive end. He finished with 10 rebounds and 3 rejections. It's a positive, but I still have so long to go and more to get better at, Smith said. You can look at it and be happy about it. But I still need to focus on what we need to work on. Houston finished last season as the league's worst rebounding team after averaging 42.0 boards. But since Smith's arrival, the Rockets are the fourth-best team at crashing the glass, averaging 46.8 rebounds. Smith is happy that he has enhanced the Rockets' struggles on the defensive end. But he is hoping to have the same impact on offense once his shooting becomes more adequate. Over the last several days, Smith said he has spent extra time in the film room studying how to improve his shooting mechanics. In 39 games, Smith has averaged 11.8 points on 38.3% shooting, 32.1% from deep. Do you agree with Coach Silas? Comment your opinion. Stay tuned by subscribing so I can keep you updated on every Houston Rockets latest news.